All right, so uh, this is my inter intervalometer circuit that I'm going to try to solder right now. See, I got my setup ready. Here's a printout uh, with all the parts, so uh, hopefully where they're supposed to be. Here's one of the boards. Uh, zoom out a little bit. There's the actual board I'm going to be working on and soldering iron and hopefully I'll have a time lapse with this camera see how it looks have a setup take that's what it's gonna look like hopefully so yeah I'm gonna get started and see what happens Okay, so I've soldered everything. Um, there's the board. It's attached to this uh, programming uh, kind of clamp header because since it's a surface mount and I didn't put any programming pins in the board, uh, that's the only way I can program it. It's connected to my AVR Dragon, um, which is a programmer, it's USB. And I don't know if it works, so I'm going to find out right now. Uh, I'm just going to program it really quick. Hopefully it works. Okay, uh, it looks like it programmed. Uh, now I just need to get a battery and test this guy to see if it actually if it actually does something. So we get a battery. Okay, so I got a battery. And actually, let me make sure this guy's off first. Then I. I think this is how it goes. Maybe. Maybe not. So if, when I turn this on, hopefully it'll blink. And it didn't. Okay. Well, that didn't work. <laughs> So I just realized I uh, programmed the wrong fuse bits onto the AVR and bricked it and I can't recover it so I'm going to figure out how to desolder it and uh, put another one on. Hope that works. Okay so I just uh, resoldered a new processor in and uh, after programming I noticed that it starts working so plug it in here and you can see the lights blinking. Uh, at every two seconds, which is what it's supposed to do. But when I plug in the battery and turn it on, that doesn't do anything. So my guess is something with the connection with the batteries off, because I am seeing some strange voltages. So I'm gonna have to check it out and see. But the good news is that the program works so my programmer little clamp thing works so that's a uh, that's good so I found a <coughs> bad solder joint on the voltage pin uh, what happened is when the clamp was holding it down it would make a connection and then when it was just floating like this it wouldn't connect at all so now if I just turn it on it seems to work. Now let's test it with a camera really quick. So here's the connector to a um, little two and a half millimeter phono jack 
And then this guy connects to the camera. Let me make sure the camera is on. All right, so here's the indoor velometer. Camera's connected, and let's see if it actually works. Whoop. Yep, it's working great. Perfect. All right, there are still some uh, other things I have to fix, but uh, this is good enough for now. Uh, yep. Yeah.